This question from Vancouver about alternatives to fossil fuels is older than the students watching this video. It's probably even older than some of the teachers. The problem isn't a lack of alternatives. The problem is who decides. Just look at the Indigenous peoples. They're fighting to protect the environment. They stand up against fracking and other harmful developments on their lands by the monopolies in violation of their sovereignty. Their right to decide isn't respected. They're treated like criminals when they say no. A society that doesn't take care of human beings, doesn't recognize the sovereign rights of the indigenous peoples or the rights of anyone else, won't take care of the natural environment either. If we don't take care of human beings and defend their rights, if we don't establish nation to nation relations with the indigenous peoples, human beings and mother earth don't stand a chance. If Canadians were the decision makers, we would have laws to protect the natural environment. Science and technology would be put in the service of both the natural and social environments. I hope you agree and I hope you'll join us to fight for democratic renewal.